and welcome to today's session on the mean. So when we're talking about the mean, it's one of the averages, and it is arguably the most accurate. It's the one that, uh, that people use more than anything else because it gives the best idea of the average. So to calculate the mean, we use uh, this, um, this calculation right here. We've got the sum of the values, so adding up all of our values divided by the number of values, so how many values we've got that we added together. So for example, we've got 12, 14, 14, 15, 15. So to find the mean of this, we're going to add them together, which we can see on the top row here. And then we're going to divide it by five because we've got one, two, three, four, five numbers. So we get 70 divided by five, which gives us 14. And 14 is our mean average for this. Now, we can get different problems where we're actually given the mean and we are asked what are um, uh, missing numbers or what is the missing number within a data set in which case we've got to actually work backwards for this so for example we've got these uh, these cartridges here with nine three five and a missing one and we're told that the mean is five and we've got to find out what that missing card is so the first thing that we're going to do we are going to work backwards we've got to bear in mind that if there are four cards that means if we multiply our mean by how many cards we've got that will give us the total that these four cards add up to equal. So we've uh, multiplied five by four, which gives us 20. Now we're gonna subtract the other three cards away from this, which leaves us with three, and three will be our missing card. I, as I've said before, I'm very much a visual learner, so I like using uh, using diagrams and visualizing them anytime my master asks to um, calculate something. So I'm hoping these uh, these visuals will help you out. Please uh, pause the video and take a look at it a bit longer if you wish. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.